Good morning, Internet. Hatch 61 here. I'm enjoying a beautiful day here in the outdoors and I uh, wanted to answer a couple questions that I received from more than, more than a couple of my viewers actually on a uh, firearm that I use probably most frequently than any of the firearms that I have and that's my Springfield M6 Scout. So I want to let you guys take a look at it. It's been featured in a couple of my videos I've done before uh, and it's very simple. Uh, perfect gun for bushcrafting, uh, survival, camping, anything like that. So let me, let me let you take a look at it. All right, there it is. This is the Springfield M6 Scout. It is a 22 caliber over 410 caliber single shot. And it is loaded because I'm out here hunting right now. So I'll take that out so you can see that it is empty now. And in the bottom chamber, it holds the 410 shell which is pretty versatile because you can use it for you know squirrel rabbit that type of stuff by choosing the type, size shot that you want or you could actually with a 410 I mean you put a 410 slug in this thing it's a, it's a weapon that can take down a deer no problem and the top barrel takes a 22 long rifle so again it's great for small game and everything else or just having a little fun around camp so put this in my pocket and show you a little bit more about the gun okay the gun it's great because with the removal of one quick pin the gun comes apart in these two pieces holds flat like that fits in the sleeve of your pack fits in your backpack uh, or if you choose to carry it uh, it's nice and light not too heavy to carry it is all steel with the exception of this little bit of rubber that's on the uh, the cheek rest here and it's a great gun the only flaw that it has is you don't lose the pin. If you want a person that loses stuff that you can't really keep stuff secure, don't take the gun apart. Just keep it folded and uh, you'll be just fine. So we'll put the pin back in. You have to close the gun and to open the gun there's a latch right here. You just simply close the gun. To open it you push up on that latch and it opens up. Uh, it has this interesting trigger unlike any other trigger. It's more of a lever and it was great because it works with mittens. You can put your whole hand in there and use the whole hand to pull the trigger. Or you could just use a you know a finger or whatever. Just like you'd pull a standard trigger. So that's pretty simple. The uh, where it fires two different barrels, of course it has two different firing pins right here. And this little knob here activates them both. Right now it's in the middle, so it's in the safety mode. So no matter what happens, it's not gonna hit any any of the firing pins. If you raise it up, now it'll fire the top barrel, which is the 22. If you push it all the way down, now it'll fire the 410 barrel. In the middle, again, is safety, and it actually has a area, you can see it right, right there. That's the safety mode, and you have to turn it to take it out. So, I mean, it's a safe gun just by the nature and design of it, uh, let alone uh, the additional safety that it, they provide. So, yeah, as far as the sights, it has two different options for sights. First sight is just a ramp front. Uh, rear sight is a peephole for the 22. You just flip it like that, and it's a notch for the uh, 410. So again, great. Let me lower this hammer. There's nothing in it, and it's on safety. Uh, I've installed a little skinning knife here for small game. Uh, I mostly use it for squirrel and rabbit and that type of stuff. Uh, it's great to have a little knife attached right to the gun. And another one of the great features is there's a button right here. Okay, so I push that button, pop it up, and you've got room for ammo storage. 22s, 410s. I got one of the 410s out already. There it is right here. They simply slide right in. And what I usually carry is I usually carry a couple shot. This is number six, and got some seven and a half, and then I carry a couple slugs. So pretty much ready to take any kind of game you want. Uh, I chose to put a sling on it. It comes with a uh, swivel mounting point right there on the front of it, and on the back uh, has a regular swivel point also. I've chosen to uh, wrap the barrel in paracord. It uh, does a couple things. First, it gives you, it's probably about 70 feet of paracord in this thing, but uh, 
It also gives you a nice place to hold on to because it is just a bare barrel. There's no forehand grip or anything like that. So pretty much that's it. It's a very simple gun. It's a great little gun. Uh, you throw it on your back, you don't even know you have it. Again, this is the Springfield M6 Scout. In my opinion, the best gun they ever discontinued. So this is Hatch 61. Thanks for coming along and keeping me company out here on this fun little squirrel hunt. I appreciate it, and I hope you folks have a great day. Keep warm. Bye-bye.